wanted to show you at least one example where the rate was not, the exponent wasn't 1. So we see here that um, if I take the first two trials, the OH is constant, so I can, it, allow me, it allows me to see what is the effect of changing the concentration of the ClO2. So if I take 0.1 divided by 0.05, I will get 2. So I see that the change between here to here is that it has been doubled. If you take 0.23 times 10 to the first, negative first, divide 0.5, excuse me, 5.75 times 10 to the negative second, if you divide this by that, you're going to see 4. Okay, so um, this was doubled. The change here is 4 times as much, so the exponent there will be squared. Okay, um, if we look for the next trial, we see 0.1 and 0.1 is the same, 0.1 to 0.5 is halved, 2.3 to 1.15 is halved, so the exponent of the OH is going to be 1. Okay, the rate laws allow us to see how does changing concentration affect the rate, um, to what power does it affect that rate mathematically given the data.